Hello everyone, this is a problem from ISI entrance, the BSTAT BMAT entrance of Indian Statistical Institute. It says that if you divide x to the power 100 by x squared minus 3x plus 2, if you divide x to the power 100 by x squared minus 3x plus 2, what is the remainder? What is the remainder of this division? So we will be using something called the remainder theorem to solve this problem. It's a very standard but beautiful problem in algebra. But it's also useful for mathematical Olympiads such as American Math Competition and IOQ. So watch the video until the end of it and then I'll ask you a question at the end. You can answer that in the comment section. So if I divide x to the power 100 by x square minus 3x plus 2, there will be some quotient q of x and some remainder r of x, right? And if you think about it, since you are dividing by a second degree polynomial, that is a quadratic, the remainder will be a first degree polynomial, right? You are dividing by a second degree polynomial, so whenever you get the power of two or more, you can divide again. So the remainder must be a first degree polynomial. It could be a zero degree polynomial, just a number, but it could be a, at most a first degree polynomial. So we can write it as ax plus b. A first degree polynomial, a standard way of writing it, is ax plus b, where a is the coefficient of the x to the power 1 term and b is the constant. If we can find a and b, we will be able to find the remainder. So let's get started. So we can write x, is, x to the power 100 as x squared minus 3x plus 2 times some quotient plus the remainder. Now the remainder is ax plus b and we want to find out a and b. We want to find out a and b. Notice that we can factorize this as x minus 2 times x minus 1, right? We can factorize it like that and we have the quotient and we have the remainder and all of it is equal to x to the power 100, right? Okay, so we are almost there. Now if we replace x by 2, replace x equals to 2, this entire part becomes 0, right? This entire part becomes 0. So we have 2 to the power 100 equals to 2a plus b. Similarly, if I replace x by 1, if I replace x by 1, I again get 1 to the power 100 equals to 1a plus b. So we, we have two unknowns and we have two equations. You can solve these two equations to get two, what is the remainder? So the remainder is ax plus b. You can solve these two equations to find the remainder of this division. So I'll do the first step. I'll just subtract the first equation from the second equation. So I get 2a plus b minus a minus b is equals to 2 to the power 100 minus 1. So I get a is equals to 2 to the power 100 minus 1. Can you find b using this particular process. Just replace the value of a in one of the equations and you'll get b. Try to find it out and tell me in the comment section. And also you can explore the website of chinta.com for outstanding programs in mathematical Olympiads, ISI CMI entrances and similar contests. I'll see you in the next one. Keep on doing good mathematics. Bye.